So, how are you? Don't pretend like you care. I'm here, aren't I? What more do I have to do? Come here, will you? Come here. Hug. Please. Oh. Ah, what are you doing? Just checking your reel. Thought I'd never see you again. As if I'd abandon you. You did. So, Dad, what have you been up to? How did you manage to get yourself out of prison? First things first. Tell me about Sugden and why you dumped this blondie shacked up within the horse trough. Maisie, isn't it? How do you know? Well, a little bird tells me you're looking after my granddaughter. Oh, you're not... Uh, uh, what's his name? Andy's real dad. Way too young to be a granddad, I know. Uh, Andy's out at the moment. Oh. Shame, I'm so looking forward to seeing him. Debbie! No, you don't! Get out! We must stop meeting like this. Get out! Now, both of you, get out! When Grandad's got a present for his little girl, that's a stone you have, Maisie. You remember Grandad, don't you, Sarah? Yeah. Go on. I won't buy it, honest. You can open it. Oh. Hey, hey, look at that! It's a real princess outfit. Is that good? Do you want to put it on? Go on, give us a princess twirl. Well, hey! Wow. Pink and it glitters. What kid can resist, eh? Just leave now. Both of you. You're off your head coming here. He pushed his way in. Told me he was your father. If I had a father, him, I'd have suffocated him at birth. Uh, not in front of Sarah, please. What are you doing out of prison? Why don't you ask a nice policeman? Go on, pick up the phone like you did last time, you know, you want to. Oh, come on, Dad. You're not taking her. Not now, not like this. You'll have to kill me first. I wouldn't think twice. But our Debbie wants to do everything by the book. So we go to court, like the upright citizens that we are. You bluffing? You're on the run, aren't you? Like the two-bit gangster you always have been. One day, when Sarah's back with her mum, where she belongs, you'll regret that. Right, sweetheart. We'll see you soon, eh? Bye. Bye, darling. Love you. Oh. Nice top you're wearing out in the yard this morning. White lace. Suited you. Hi, honey, I'm home. Where's our money? I thought we could all behave like grown-ups. Answer the question. And why aren't you banged up where you belong? Dad, what are you doing? Just asking these good people if we can put our history behind us. Shake on it. Move forward to a new tomorrow. Sounds reasonable to me. Oi! You gotta give us it or not? No. So you're not gonna shake on it then? Can't say I didn't try. Okay. Sorry to hear you off to your brother and your dad. Heard from your ex-wife recently. Oh. Jimmy! Jimmy, get off me! Get away! Come on then, soft boy, if you think you're hard enough. Oh. Oh. Get away! Get off me. <laughs> Come on, fight back, Kay. What's the matter? You gotta bust me, man. Come on! Come on, you gotta help my dad, quick! Fight back! Fight! Oh. Oh. Hey, what are you doing? Don't do that to me! <laughs> I told you to keep out of it! Oh, Lacking it up from this purr! Nice to see you too! I'll kill him! Yeah. Oh, oh. Honestly, what's the game? Two on one, man! I'll leave charge now! Don't fight! We're seeing you, lads. Get off! Inside, now! What the hell are you cleaning up? When he said surprise, I thought he meant dancy girls in bikinis. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody get the lad a drink, Paddy. <laughs> Welcome home, son. Cheers, Zach. Cheers, Dad. 
Not wishing to be too controversial, but you still top of Interpol's most wanted list. Yeah, yeah, wouldn't you like to know? So, Paddy! Oh. How's it like sleeping without a chat? Brilliant, actually. Really good, thanks. Leave him alone. I thought you was in prison. Oh! Oh, hey. It's like yeah. seeing a ghost. Yeah. So, why are you walking into bandit country and arms? Yeah, why don't you fight back? There's a price to pay. Now it's settled. Let's hope that's the end of it. You really think they'll leave it at that? Why wouldn't they? Let's go to the time. I'll pay my juice next time. Oh, I don't like the sound of that. So you'll be staying around a few days, then? I wasn't here before when Debbie needed me, but I am now. I'll do what I have to to make sure she gets Sarah back. And after that? I'm sick of running. Sick of looking over my shoulder. I've come home. For good this time. And nobody and nothing's gonna drive me away. He got what he deserved because he's a murderer. <coughs> <coughs> There's only one murder around here, and that's you. <coughs> He's been found guilty. Yeah, but we both know different, don't we? <coughs> if the court ain't gonna make you pay, looks like it's gonna be down to me. Your second best, hey. I don't care. You know you want me. Will you stop it? When are you going to get it through your thick head? We're over. I don't mean that. Look, we're really good together. I can't do this anymore. I've made my mind up. I'm marrying Chaz. No, you're not. Oh! Oh! <laughs> hey! Do one, Barbie. You're an embarrassment. What's going on? You! Don't bother turning up Saturday. Wedding's off. Hey, chaps. Great. What do you want? I want you to walk out that door and leave us alone. Well, excuse me, this is my factory. Well, aren't you the lucky boy? You're still here. I'm not going anywhere. Look, it's okay. It's nothing that I can't handle. There's a good boy. Pretty pleased with yourself. Bound to. Cracking bird charity. She loves a big house, posh car, plenty of cash. Bet you like buying things for her and all. Is there a point to all this? <laughs> well, I wouldn't waste my time when I cause you a little chat. Not with a loser like you. <laughs> now, you calling me a loser. Yeah, that is interesting. And a sucker. You see, as far as charity is concerned, this is just another transaction. You give, she takes. That's how she operates. Look, if you're here to tell me about charity's past, then don't bother. I know everything. I doubt it. I'm not interested. I bet you thought it was all posh hotel rooms. Suits like you, having a bit of naughty on the side. Half an hour's fumble, and back home in time for your tea. She did what she had to do. <laughs> she must have seen you coming a mile off. You see, our charity was more of a backstreet girl. She was anyone's for a tenner. You know, it makes no difference to me. Wow. You really are thick, aren't you? She's just using you. You're just the latest in a long line of rich mugs. She'll have a fun, screw you for a few grand and dump you. And then she'll come back to me. Happens every time. <laughs> now, if you've got any sense, you'll get out while you can. Tell them, slip. How did you get it? Never mind that. Get out! After I've gone to so much trouble, what's your sense of adventure? They're gonna kill you! I can't really say that. Especially if we're quiet. Although that might be a bit of a problem with you and me. Well, then I will kill you. Let's see how we get on out. <sighs> well, no creaking so far. Although, it is early days yet. <sighs> <sighs> Mate, don't mind me, you carry on. 
You might be a lot of things, Charity, but shy, definitely not one of them. I am warning you, Kane. You need to get out now. Or else. Charity, you all right? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Good answer. In fact, no, I'm not. You know, I like that abandoned just go out the bath look. Suits you. Are you sure? I can hear him. What the flaming hell is going on? Nothing. Especially not where you stood there anyway. Not in my house, no way. You on your bike now. Do you always barge into a lady's room without knocking? I mean, that's well out of order, isn't it? At least I was invited. Beg your pardon? How did you get in? Ask her. So this is why you wanted us to stay at the pub? No! What, you're not allowed guests back? Come on, Jay. That's well old-fashioned, mate. Well, go on then. What is he doing here? Honestly, think I would let him in, do you? Come on! God, I kept my pants on now. Could have been well embarrassing. You were dead for this. Yeah, now we know where Nikhil's keys went, don't we? What, these? You never told me you'd nicked him. I never touched him! I've got my own, thank you! Subtle touch, she. She's good. I'll give her that much. Or do you know that already? How about I give you a smack? You're out! Lifting somebody's keys? Why didn't you just ask him? He's lying. Yeah, somebody is. Right! You've probably pinched him from the Something. And why would I want to do that? What am I? Desperate? Er, uh, yeah. You absolute. Look, Kane, I tell you what, just go, will you? Yeah. Romantic mood's kind of worn off a bit now. A bit like last night. Oh, I will have you for this. That is not what she was saying just before you barged in. Close. Now, if you don't mind. All right, okay. No problem. Maybe next time, eh, sweetheart? Somewhere a bit less public. Get out! Oh, watch that tail doesn't fall off. <laughs>